Obviously, uh, extremely disappointed about the outcome of the game. I think the young men uh, did play hard. Obviously, the score did not indicate that. But in that locker room, we got a bunch of guys that are hurting, along with a bunch of coaches and a bunch of other people that are members of the family. We've got to find something to hang our hat on. We've got to t get into this break, and we've got to dig deep and find something out about ourselves and hopefully bring something to the surface that we can be proud of the next time we step on the football field. Questions? On your right, Coach, Dan. Coach, you talk about Ohana and family and all of those you know, pieces and those elements when you came in. Now that you're going into a bye, how do you keep that going? How do you establish that? How do you kind of you know, try and go back to that foundation as you move forward? Well, we're going to always do that. That's something we're not going to get away from. But as we go into this bye, we're constantly working to get better, and we're constantly looking for new members that want to contribute. But this is going into a bye after a loss like this is difficult. I'm not going to sit up here and try to paint it a different way. But we're going to really find out something about ourselves. And uh, as iron sharpens iron, one man sharpens another. And we're going to need all the men in the family to keep everyone sharp so we can have an opportunity to be the best that we can be when we come out of this bye. Mark, coach on your left. Uh, coach, uh, your defense forced a couple turnovers, uh, and, and the offense turned it into points. 17-10 in the first quarter, and then just what happened with defense? It, it just did not seem to have any answer. Yeah, it, it just got tired of hitting Dylan and, uh, and his backup, obviously. And then those, those play action passes are just, they just break your back. You know, you're in man coverage, and there's, this, I would imagine that we were in man coverage. I haven't checked the tape, but when you play a, a running game like that, you're normally in a lot of man. And to have somebody just scot free like that when somebody's got two sets of eyes watching them is, is disappointing. But uh, we'll go back, we'll check the tape, and figure out what happened. But obviously, uh, it wasn't very good. Andrew? Um, Dino right over here. On a similar note, when you know you're going to get A.J. Dillon running the ball and his backups hitting Bailey like they did, was there any thoughts through this week to maybe roll more guys through the defensive line, through the linebacking quarter? Did you guys pressure for that second, third, fourth quarter? Or was there sort of you also have to play the guys who are the best guys you can play? I guess that would that balance. Well, it, it, it's kind of like the uh, best analogy that I can, I can, I can give you is when you, when you go into a big fight, there's normally big fighters on one side and big fighters on another side, and you want the biggest guys to go after the biggest guys, and hopefully the small guys will handle the small guys. The starters are the, are the best guys to go after somebody like Dylan when you start going into twos and threes, and we rotated a lot of people. But you start going in after those twos and threes, and when they hit them, it's just not the same. He just kind of mashes through them. They're not ready for that kind of impact. It's a heavyweight fighter versus a welterweight. And, uh, you know, so you want to stick with your starters as much as you can. There was rotations going on, but there wasn't, there wasn't enough. He just had too much for us. We, we, we rotate it, but uh, you can only keep your guys out there when they're fresh. You, to put a, quiet, uh, a tired guy out there to hit those two backs, is, it's not smart. So they, they went as long as they could. I think if you watch the game, there was guys tapping, and when they tapped, we got a guy in there right away, got him water on the sidelines. As soon as they could, they could get an opportunity to get back, we pushed them back out there because they're the best we've got.